Now to a big Santa Fe strong milestone. The police officer wounded in the school shooting at Santa Fe High School has now been released from rehab and he's now back home with his family recovering. The League City Police Department shared this video of Officer John Barnes' homecoming. A big show of support for this retired Houston police officer. Very moving. Now new at 6 o'clock, we're hearing from Officer Barnes himself. Our Roseanne Aragon joining us live in Santa Fe with the story you will see only on two. Roseanne? <laughs> That's right, Officer Barnes tells me he is now moving his finger, something he couldn't do a month ago when he was flown from this school to UTMB. He says he's not ready to go on camera, but he wanted to share his deep appreciation for all of the people who have helped him get to this milestone. When it seemed everything was uncertain and panic and chaos filled Santa Fe High, Officer John Barnes knew what he had to do, keep students safe. People think that... Uh... You know, it's just the big cities and stuff where you get, it's dangerous, and uh, obviously it's not, right? Any, anytime you put that uniform on and go to work, anywhere, anything could happen. Barnes is the officer who took a bullet from the lone gunman who took the lives of 10 people May 18th. Barnes was shot in the elbow and nearly bled to death. I was expecting to wake up, but uh, I was expecting to wake up with a stump. Uh, when Gary put that tourniquet on, I knew what that meant. You know, I knew I would probably lose that arm if I did that. But it's better than not being here. After three surgeries, relocating veins from his legs to his arm, skin grafts, and 10 days of intubation, he got the homecoming of a hero. I wanted to make sure that people understand how much it's helped me and my family and uh, how much, how, how absolutely I totally appreciate uh, everything everybody's doing. He is still fighting, taking it one day at a time. And it'll be a long time. But look, as long as I can move my hand good and pick up a glass of whiskey every once in a while, that'll be fine with me, <laughs> you know? What an incredible story there. Right now, he has what's called an external fixator. That's metal rods that are drilled into his elbow. That is temporary, and hopefully with some therapy and another surgery, he's hoping he will eventually fully recover. And he certainly has the support here in this community to help him through. Reporting live in Santa Fe, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, Channel 2 News. We wish him well, Roseanne. Thank you.